Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com with a little more hot palm pre action for you. And uh, as you can see right there in my Gmail notification from the big boss, the head phone dog himself, we're working on a little pre round table for you. Um, since there are uh, four of us phone doggers who currently have access to a palm pre, um, you know, you don't want just my thoughts on it. You're getting my thoughts, and hopefully you want my thoughts, whether you agree with them or not. But uh, we want to give you other perspectives, too, because mine is just one perspective, right? So Tom, Aaron, Rebecca have all had uh, a chance to, to check out the pre for a little while, and uh, we're going to get their thoughts. I'm moving the light, trying to get rid of this glare here. We're uh, going to get their thoughts on the device as well. So stay tuned for, uh, for that on PhoneDog.com uh, in a written format. Check that out. You know. All you who watch the videos, you should know, we have a whole website over there on phonedog.com. We have uh, reviews, blog posts, shopping tools, forums, games, all kinds of business. So uh, you're going to want to check that out. But in the meantime, we're here to talk about some accessories. Uh, Sprint and Palm were kind enough um, with my review loaner, which is a loaner, not a free phone, not keeping it. Michael Arrington, don't get on my case, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm sending it back at the end of seven days, I promise you. Uh, Leo Laporte, if he says he is, he is too. But you guys kissed and made up, so it's all good. Anyway, uh, Sprint and Palm also provided the Touchstone charging kit and the vehicle power charger. Uh, these are optional accessories. Touchstone's gotten a lot of uh, press because it's a wireless charging solution. $69.99. The vehicle power charger, $29.99. We'll look at the power charger first since it's going to be a little more uh, straightforward, cut and dry, I would think. And, um, you know, basically it's... Uh, it's a charger for your car, so you can plug this into your car's, uh, they don't call them cigarette lighters anymore, they call them accessory ports, or accessory chargers, or something like that. Um, but uh, I don't even know, if you, I think you have to get like an extra adapter to light your cigarettes with it now. When you buy a car, I don't know. Anyway, so basically what you get in here is you get uh, a USB cable, and a car adapter and uh, a little adapter adapter. So you plug this into your car and you plug, I suppose I could look at the instructions, but what fun would that be? You plug that into the adapter and uh, you plug this into your Palm Pre right there on the side. So I assume this could be used with uh, other micro USB based devices as well. Which makes me wonder if you already have a charger, a micro USB based charger, could you plug it into your Palm Pre without uh, destroying your Pre, frying it in the process due to some kind of voltage or inversion issues or something. I don't know. Uh, if you try it, you're at your own risk, but certainly let us know. And then uh, this little adapter guy I want to look at the instructions to see what the point of that thing is. Because I'm not so smart about these things. This is the warranty. There are no instructions. They're like, dude, it's so self-explanatory. Oh, here we go. Okay. All right. So this is if you're not using a pre. Gotcha. Okay. So you've got the one micro USB thing. And then if you've got um, like a Trio Pro, it looks like. I don't have my Trio Pro anymore, so I can't tell. But uh, a device that has the older style Palm proprietary uh, charger then you can use it that way. Or if you've got the pre, it's micro USB based. So there you go. $29.99, uh, you know, all these accessories, not just Palm, but everybody makes accessories, they, they jack up the prices a little bit. I think, uh, you know, you could probably find a, uh, a generic adapter for less, but then again, you're getting generic quality. So I will reserve judgment and just say, there you go. I'll try it out in my car, let you know how it works. And here's the Touchstone charging kit. This is 70 bucks, which I think is an awful lot uh, for, what it, for what it does. And um, I have heard and read reports from our own phone dog Aaron as well that the charging on this bad boy is slow. It's much slower than charging the phone directly via micro USB. Um, basically, it's a wireless charging solution. So you get in the box, all this crazy orange. It's so orange. So the $70 kit, you get your touchstone charging base here. You 
and it does not come with an additional USB cable so you have to plug this into your uh, your original charger that comes with the pre. They have other kits that are more expensive that come with that other stuff but uh, it looks like with this one you've got to use the USB cable and charger that came with the original pre which you know I guess is fine I don't know they they have another kit that is called the uh, I'm gonna look it up here on the website it's called the touchstone charging expansion kit and this one's 70 bucks I mean uh, 80 bucks rather you see that right there touchstone charging expansion kit 79.99 and that one comes with an additional charger and uh, you know, I know it's the way the business works, and, and this isn't a jab at Palm as much as just a jab at the business, but, like, why do that? Why not just have one? Why not, you know, make it just one price and that's it? And so that way when you get the wireless charger, you feel like you're getting a little bit more for your money. And, um, you know, you're getting yourself kind of a second charging option. So, and granted, you know, micro USB cables aren't that expensive if you get a non-palm branded one. And you can just, uh, you know, you probably have them lying around. But I don't know, I just feel like if you're going to spend 70 bucks for the charger, get the charger, and then also have another cord with it. So now you have two charging solutions, the one that came with the Pre and a whole separate one. Instead of now, you got to get another cable or use your old cable. Anyway, that's my little rant. But, uh, so basically, we'll plug this in and you hook it up with the micro USB here and then come on Delilah there you go and then I'm just gonna plug this into my computer because it's closer than plugging it into the wall so I'm plugged in I don't see any sort of indicator light letting me know it's happening. Uh, and then you also get the special touchstone back cover for the pre. And as you can see, it's more of a matte finish than the glossy finish, which um, some people might just like this better anyway. Less of a fingerprint magnet. The pre is definitely a fingerprint magnet. Not really that big of a deal, but just, you know, noticeably because it's so glossy and everything that, uh, you know. So. The touchstone back is a little more of a matte, kind of grippy feel, and uh, I would assume this will give you less fingerprints. Yeah, definitely. You can see with the glossy one, when I rub my greasy thumb over it, you get smears and smudges. With the touchstone charger, not as much. So I kind of, kind of like that. And so let's see if I put this down. Is it working? Or am I not? hooked up. Maybe it won't charge via my computer. Let's plug it in to the wall like we're supposed to. And there you go. Now we're charging. You can see up there in the corner the charging icon. And it's cool. You know, it's a little magnetic. So, kind of just drops into place. It's very cool how it holds it in place. The bottom of the dock itself has kind of a grippy, sticky rubber pad, so it sits on the desk nicely or your nightstand or whatever. Very cool, charging battery. It's very cool. I think they should cut the price to like 30 bucks and then they'd sell a ton of these. Maybe they're selling like hotcakes anyway because people who get them, uh, you know, People who get the pre just really want to rock the uh, the wireless charger because it's so cool. Uh, and then it, it, it'll do things like if you get a call, it will let you pick up the call uh, without having to tap anything on the screen. So let's see. If I got somewhere where I can make a phone call here. Phone call coming in, and uh, I'm going to block out the number here so you don't see it. Alright, so I'm getting a call, and I lifted off the touchstone, and 
now I'm in the call. So that's pretty cool. You know, this is on your desk. You just pick it up, automatically answers the call. Very nice. Now I'm talking to myself like Billy Idol. Dancing with myself. So there you go. First look at a couple of the pre accessories. The auto charger, 30 bucks. Uh, compatible with other Palm devices as well because it comes with the adapter. And then the Touchstone charging kit. This is the basic charging kit. It is $70. The expansion touchstone kit, which comes with another uh, micro USB cable and AC adapter, is $80. And again, my understanding is that the, uh, my understanding from Phone Dog Aaron, so I'll take him at his word, is that the charging on this device, on the touchstone charger, is slow. So, uh, you know, I also, if you've seen online, there are people being say, saying that they estimate that it cost Palm like five bucks. For the components in the charger. I don't know if that's true. I'd love to see the touchstone come down from 70 to like 30. I know that's a lot, but that'd be pretty sweet. But it's a cool, uh, cool concept. Hopefully we'll see more of this wireless induction charging very soon. All right, there you go. Another look. Palm Pre and the accessories. Much, much more on the Pre and all the other stuff over on PhoneDog.com. Until next time, I'm Noah. Thanks for watching. See ya.